Hey guys, so since I was doing the cloth diaper update, I figured I'll do his nine month update. Tayshawn is doing great. As you can see, he's having more snack. Um, I was actually going to fix lunch at one o'clock, but um, he's having such a late snack. He had a late breakfast, late snack, and late lunch. Um, <laughs> so I guess we'll eat lunch about 1.30 or 2 o'clock if he's still hungry. Um, he already had a banana. He's actually hungry. He's ready for lunch. Anyway, he, as you can see, is feeding himself. He eats everyday food. Um, I do give him baby food occasionally, um, oatmeal, uh, just basically the baby cereal. In fact, I might run and go get that for you guys so you can see it, but, um, it's just a baby, it's like Gerber baby food, and I'll just use, um, a can of, um, fruit and I'll just add a little bit of water or milk or formula I do sometimes I use formula because um, just to add the extra nutrition instead of just using water or regular milk and that's gone <laughs> yeah normally he eats in his high chair um, he is crawling he is taking a few steps um, here we go can I bite He's crawling, he's taking a few steps, um, holding on. He can stand himself up and support it for a few seconds. You don't need that. For a few seconds, and then um, he plays with food. He kind of um, prefers his left hand to his right. So I don't know if he's going to be left-handed or not. We'll see. Um, he is in a 12-month clothing um Right now he's a, he, right now this is 18 months and the pants are, I think are 2T. So yeah, this is a little big on him and yeah, it's gone. Yeah, right now he's in a, the pants are 2T and I got them folded up at the bottom. They also have the string inside, um, the little elastic inside to tighten it up so it works really well with the cloth diapers or with disposables. Um, for him, the shirt is 18 month, but I have the sleeves rolled up. But he fits a 12 month perfectly. He cannot fit into nine months. Nine months is just too small. Um, he watches TV sometimes, occasionally. His favorite character, um, favorite toy is Barney. He actually liked the show too, but um, mostly just singing and music. He doesn't really care too much for the storyline or anything like that. Um, He's really interested in cars and trucks, and um, he has two words. He says, bye-bye, which is really cute, because especially when he waves, it says bye-bye. He also says mama, and that's about the gist of it. Um, he does still say hi, but it's more like um, play. I don't know if he's actually saying hi to people. He's, he will say bye-bye to you when he wants you to go away. Um, let's see. And yeah, I told you he's crawling. He and I are still, we're still co-sleeping because he doesn't sleep in his crib anymore. I'm trying to get him to sleep in there more and a little bit more often. But, um, he sleeps better with me and I sleep better and it's just easier to sleep all night than to, um, be waking up two or three times a night to try to soothe him and get him to go back to sleep. So, yeah, I, it's pure laziness or pure just... The want of sleep, rather have sleep than to have him um, in his bed. I, I don't know if I mentioned it before, but I took my bed, my mattress, I took my bed apart and I'm sleeping on a mattress on the floor, which sucks. And that's mainly because I didn't want him rolling off onto the floor from the bed or, um, so at this point he can actually crawl around the room and get on the bed and lay down. Sometimes he does that when he's tired or he likes, wants to watch, he just wants to lay and relax. Um... Let me see what else is there. Told you he's eating. Um, one thing about cloth diaper I did not mention was that I did not. I mean, I knew babies use less diapers as they got older. I did not even realize how many less diapers it would be with cloth diapers. I mean, it just seems like when you're using disposables, you just go through them so fast. But when it's cloth diapers, you just you're not going. You're not losing them. You know, you just you're not you're not running out. You're just using them. So. Like I said in the um, other video, he used about five to six diapers a day. Sometimes, um, 
depending on what he eats or, you know, if I breastfeed him more, if he's drinking more and more, you know. Um, okay, he d sometimes stays with his sisters. I leave my older, leaving with my older kids, and they will use formula, supplement formula. And sometimes they will just give him a bottle after a bottle after a bottle instead of fixing him food because they are afraid of him choking. So they don't like giving him real food. Which I don't mind it. I mean, honestly, I'd rather them just give them milk than to give them real food and he choke. And then them, they have to actually put into practice what they learn in the babysitting CPR class. Which, yeah, I'd rather not that happen. So, um, yeah. <laughs> when they watch him, he just drinks formula. And obviously, if he's drinking that much liquid, he's going to go through more and more diapers. Um, uh, bah, bah. He does a lot of talking. He loves to talk. Uh, bah, bah. And he stands and he holds onto things and he walks. He loves to bang things. And he does this little growling thing. Um, his sister got him doing it. I don't know. She be growling at him and then he starts doing it. He does it to people. This is how he talk. And he does this thing with the he click. <laughs> He does a tea thing. I think he thinks I think he thinks this language is some kind of part of speech. So he does it. Um also I'm great changing because he's made a mess of himself. But um he is still throwing up mostly when he drinks a lot of liquid and it's only a little bit um you can tell when he's had a lot of milk and formula because that's the only thing he throws up he doesn't throw up when he has solid food one thing that's new though he's had um hiccups a few times that was like really really seemed like it was really hard hiccups yeah so yeah that's basically it he has met all his milestones and he is doing great. I have to get some gates. I haven't gotten any yet because because he has started going up the steps. He got up to the third step while I was standing at the front door. I'm like, oh my gosh. Didn't expect that. But I should have when he started crawling. Um, and I'm about to feed him some real food because he's still looking for more banana. Um, <laughs> he's hating his car seat now. He, um... He likes to dance. He likes to sing. Um, it's a lot of fun. <laughs> That's all I got. It's fun playing with him during the day. He got his Barney. And he's going to get banana all over. So I'm going to wash it again. Okay, so that's just about it with Tay Sean. I don't need, I don't think anything else. I mean, he is still wearing his teething ring, teething necklace, and he has four, four teeth. I didn't even realize he had the top teeth until I was playing for one day, and I held him like down this way, his head down, and I looked, I saw these little things at the top. I didn't even realize it. And yes, I am breastfeeding, and he has, he has bit me before with the bottom ones, but he hasn't bit me with the top ones. Um. He bit me like a couple of times and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm about to quit. But I didn't. We hung in there. We got through that. And so far he hasn't bitten me anymore. But yeah, he has four teeth. I'm like amazed by that. Um, His hair didn't fall out. Like his brothers and sisters. Well, some of them. Not all my kids had hair fall out. But his hair didn't fall out. And so I guess it's just going to be the way it is. And um. Uh, that's it. That's all I got to say. So, bye guys.